Blood pressure is the force of your blood pushing against the walls of your arteries. Think of it like water flowing through a hose. When the water pressure is high, the hose feels stiff. Similarly, high blood pressure means your heart has to work harder to pump blood. Blood pressure is measured in two numbers, systolic and diastolic. Systolic pressure is the higher number, measuring the pressure when your heart beats. Diastolic pressure, the lower number, measures the pressure between beats. Maintaining normal blood pressure is crucial for overall health. High blood pressure, also known as hypertension, can lead to serious health problems like heart disease and stroke. Low blood pressure, on the other hand, can cause dizziness and fainting. Understanding what causes abnormal blood pressure is the first step toward prevention and management. Factors like genetics, diet, lifestyle, and underlying medical conditions all play a role. High blood pressure is often called the silent killer because it often has no symptoms. Over time, this constant strain on your arteries can damage your heart, blood vessels, and other organs. Several factors can contribute to high blood pressure. Genetics play a role. If your parents have high blood pressure, you're more likely to develop it too. Unhealthy lifestyle choices like a diet high in salt, saturated fat, and cholesterol also contribute to the problem. Lack of physical activity is another culprit. Regular exercise helps strengthen your heart and improve blood flow. Stress, smoking, and excessive alcohol consumption can also raise your blood pressure. In some cases, high blood pressure is a symptom of an underlying medical condition like kidney disease or thyroid disorders. Managing these conditions is essential for controlling blood pressure. While high blood pressure is a common concern, low blood pressure can also be problematic. Low blood pressure or hypotension occurs when the force of blood pushing against your artery walls is too low. Dehydration is one of the most common causes of low blood pressure. When your body loses more fluids than it takes in, your blood volume decreases, leading to a drop in blood pressure. This is why it's crucial to stay hydrated, especially during hot weather or after strenuous exercise. Certain heart conditions, like a slow heart rate or heart valve problems, can also cause low blood pressure. These conditions prevent the heart from pumping blood effectively, leading to reduced pressure in the arteries. Section 4. Other Factors Influencing Blood Pressure Beyond the common culprits, other factors can temporarily or chronically affect blood pressure. Hormonal changes, for example, can influence blood pressure levels. During pregnancy, women experience hormonal shifts that can lead to lower blood pressure. Medications, both prescription and over-the-counter, can impact blood pressure. Some medications like decongestants and pain relievers can raise blood pressure. Conversely, medications like diuretics and beta blockers are used to lower blood pressure. Postural changes, such as standing up too quickly, can cause a sudden drop in blood pressure, leading to dizziness or fainting. This is known as orthostatic hypotension and is more common in older adults. Section 5. Lifestyle Modifications Taking Charge of Your Health Making healthy lifestyle choices can significantly impact your blood pressure. Regular physical activity is crucial for maintaining a healthy weight and strengthening your heart. Aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate-intensity exercise most days of the week. Dietary changes are equally important. Reduce your salt intake by limiting processed foods, fast food, and restaurant meals. Eat a balanced diet rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and lean protein. Stress management techniques like deep breathing exercises, yoga, and meditation can help lower blood pressure. If you smoke, quitting is one of the best things you can do for your heart, health, and overall well-being. Section 6. The Importance of Medical Guidance Monitoring your blood pressure regularly is essential, especially if you have risk factors for hypertension. If you notice any abnormal readings, consult your doctor. Early detection and treatment are crucial for preventing complications. Your doctor will likely ask about your medical history, family history, and lifestyle habits. They may recommend further tests, such as blood tests or an electrocardiogram to rule out any underlying conditions. Treatment for abnormal blood pressure varies depending on the underlying cause and severity. Lifestyle modifications are often the first line of treatment, but medication may be necessary in some cases. Remember, self-treating is never advised. 